This is the final assembly of my T84 with my hollowed out bearing in the rear and I've installed a 10,000 shim in the rear. 25 thousandths was just too much in causing a binding. So I'm in neutral and as you can see the front and rear shaft turn independent of one another which is a good sign indicating that uh, the front of my output shaft is not impinging on the rear recess of my input shaft. And looking at the, uh, the spacing on the dogs here and the rear side, I've got a small space there. Slightly larger space, but nothing uh, out of the ordinary. And about the same space over here. And similar situation here from the front. Spacing and spacing there. Now, with the gear connected as such, I've got rotational movement on the front blocking ring and slight fore and aft movement here. And with the other gear engaged and detached from the cone, I get rotational movement and a slight fore and aft play in that. So I think my setup is good with everything rotating properly and we're going to call this one good and I'll install my final uh, bearing, rear bearing in the main case.